was one lady shared the story that her son went to uh, Japan and happened to see and talk to a Japanese guy and talking about atomic bomb and the Japanese guy said well, we will forgive you but that story really touched her and she was crying and well but it's so hard to forgive ourselves though she is against or she is working for the peace but she feels a really huge guilt inside of her maybe that is a motivation to work for the peace but mm -hmm. that's really so what america did in japan it still affected her these yeah. many decades later mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and i believe so many when i talk to americans and i, I always explain and that i'm from nagasaki and I'm from the, the center of the explosion. My house is there, and some people, American people, froze. They have nothing to talk. You know, they, they have no word to talk to me. And while I'm talking, at, at they, some of them think that we hate Americans, but we don't. Some maybe still have anger inside. But since Amer Nagasaki is a Christian and Urakami is a Christian village, no, the Christian had a hard time living in Japan since of the government decided no Christian in Japan. So for 300 years or so, they had a really hard time. But um, and build, they were in jail or you know. Uh, murdered or or whatever you know I don't know the word but 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 still they survive and live in that town in, in our village and build up you know pinching money and build up a big cathedral taking years and years maybe 30 years and after th almost 30 years same Christian came and bombed and a lot of Christian died but still they believe that they have a word let's um, transform this to a pray and pray let's forgive what happened you know of course there are some many some people are still in anger and a hard time but we want to be connect to you mm -hmm not really angry or want to have a good relationship we love Americans and you will see if you come to Japan people will be really super welcome to you really super welcome why do Americans when you tell them you're from Nagasaki why do they freeze that? maybe they have nothing no words or it was too shock or too sensitive topic to talk about or felt guilty I don't know but mm -hmm. it seems that when I tell told him that oh we Japanese and we Nagasaki people love Americans and he it seems that he felt released oh really I want to see and communicate to people and find out the future so please come to the movie as much people I'd like to see and bring those you know information to to people in Japan and they will love they will be really released to that we could just ordinary people like me and ordinary people like you can communicate and cooperate with each other now not not politically or not governmentally or anything, just a root grassroots relation mm -hmm. that really encourage people in Japan. Yeah. Well, thank you. Thank Thanks you very for, much. All right. We'll look forward to seeing you on Monday. Yes. Okay. Thank you very much. Yeah. You're welcome.